Ecom Society here back in now. Action, this is part five of Ecom Society versus Lucky Rat Casino. I'm back in action. As you guys can see, my balance right now is 1420 bucks. And uh, I started with a $500 deposit, so we're going <coughs> to continue to scale up here, you know what I'm saying? Because I want to show you guys that, you know, when you use your brain, you can actually be uh, successful at it, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to do this, get this easy money. It's all about risk management. That's how you succeed. Whether it's gambling, business, relations, you know, lifestyle, everything comes down to risk management, how you manage your risk. How you manage your risk. All right. So, I'll show you guys how easy this is. Let's allow it. Doesn't matter what casino I'm at, I win all the time. Well, most of the time, not all the time, but uh, some casinos are more generous than others, and uh, some casinos' RNG is actually more, like I said, it's more generous in terms of payback percentage. And I find that this casino is extraordinarily uh, generous with their payback percentage. Okay. All right, I'll start off slow. So I'm back to base unit.
No, we got three reds and one black. So. Right about now, the RNG has picked up on our betting patterns, and uh, we're going to adapt to the situation. Like I always said, do not uh, constantly uh, stick to the same, you know, strategy. That's 34 and 30, uh, 34 and 31. To 1375, we started at uh, 1420. All right, we're at 23. We are in range. Refresh. We're back to four, uh, 1400. We start at 1420. That's why it's important to adapt to uh, the situation. You know what I'm saying? to 1425 all right that's black 29 unit size is compounding table limit is 100 There you go. Let's get a right number, come on. I like 22. Okay.
Not a problem. Not a problem. Um. Fifteen. Okay. Six. All right, not a problem. We're down like uh, two hundred and twenty. is a game that um even if you're you take a big hit you can easily uh scale back up you know what i'm saying well we got black 11 um black 11 black six clear all all right black 11 and black 6 
the hell? Okay. This is Act the Dump. All right, whatever. This shit come on. I need a strip of black shit. It's, it's bound to be broken. Yeah, I thought I knew it. I told you. Now we're down 120. This is the realities of gambling. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Red 30. What's that? Red 30, Black 11. So close. All right. We're in range. There's a uh, Down like, uh, we're only down like six, seventy bucks. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, that's the, what, what number was that? Black 15? Alright, that's, that's the realities of gambling. You know what I'm saying? Especially when you're going up against RNGs. You need to make, uh, assess the situation. And, uh, Counteract against them. If you see that, you know, the payback percentage is not as high when you're doing a certain strategy, then you need to switch up on them. You still need to calculate, you know, do your little visual ballistics and so forth. Red 25, good. Red all. Alright, got red 25. I don't I'm like hell, how's that a hundred?
34, that was a hunch. I knew that zero was gonna come out. It don't matter to me, I'm still gonna be profitable. This video might be very long, by the way. But this is the realities of online gambling. So I always want to play the game expecting it to be, um, you know, in the table of the casino, obviously. But that does not mean you cannot do it. I'm down like 120. It's that red black. Okay, let's clear it all. Doing some red 12 and doing some damage control. And Four. Okay, not a problem.
It's all about damage control, lowering your bet units, uh, unit size, um, depending on how the roulette wheel is moving. This is the realities of gambling. It's not going to be every day that you know, you're going to be up multiple units um, at the start. We're like 26 minutes into the video. I'm down only, uh, start of 14, 20. I'm down, uh, you know, about 40 bucks. But persistence is key and remaining focus is key. So, you know, we're going to continue. Just over this, clear all. All right. So it's important to have a very big bankroll because if I would have a little bankroll, if I would have if I would have gone through this little you know slight cold streak at five hundred dollar bankroll, I would have been I would have gone bust a long time ago. That was a hedge. Exactly how you gotta play. Get a high number.
Black 11. That was a hedge. Already three low numbers. Let's get a high number. Come on. At eighteen. Okay. I just got fucked over right there, but that's fine. to give me the high number, right? What the hell am I doing? I'm actually calling all the numbers that are not in the uh, next to each other in the video. That's what I'm doing. Like on the actual uh, roulette wheel. So that gives me uh, a high chance of hitting. And of course, the only number I don't have covered comes out. So. Uh, so these RNGs are designed. You know what I'm saying? They're not designed. They're not. A, they're not a charity. They're designed to take your money. But again, it don't matter. It's 
Star Run 3. Wow. Wow, they're seriously countering me, son. That shit is crazy. But that's fine, though. You know what I'm saying? That is fine. They are seriously countering me. But that's okay. They can do all the content they want. I'm a professional. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't matter if it takes an hour. It doesn't matter if it takes two hours or whatever. I'm playing the slow, strategic, and tactical Black 15. Okay. Uh, that's two blacks, one red. All right. There you go. Now we're up ahead. By $15 in 40 minutes. Not, uh, doesn't matter though. Because we're going to be up ahead even more. Stat red 21. I'll probably title this video uh, Risk Management because I feel like I'm managing my risk extremely well. You know what I'm saying? Not chasing losses or anything like that. I hate it when they do that. I seriously hate it when they do that. Uh, okay. I just broke even right here. Um, now the count resets. There you go. And that thirty two. That took a long, 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 long time. A very long time. So, um, that was basically 100 bucks in 40 minutes. Um, <coughs> one little tip I'll, I will give you guys uh, when you guys are playing against the RNG is that they still have to have, have to have a RTP, return to player payback percentage, you know what I'm saying, based on your unit size, as you guys can see. Um, depending on how you manage your risk, depends on whether you come up ahead or not. So let me just go back. I'm gonna stop it right there because I'm up a hundred bucks in 40 minutes. But that took a way too long compared to how I usually play. And that's probably because they're catching on to the patterns and trends. But like I said, it does not matter because I'm a professional. I know what I'm doing. I've done this thousands and thousands of time. Uh, started with a $500 deposit. I'm already up. At uh, $1,550, all right. So I'm basically up 300%. And this is this is a part five video series. I did uh, win a little aggressive on some rounds. Let me just <coughs> go back. And I don't recommend you know you guys going that aggressive when you start. It's not it's not it's not good to like go crazy. You know what I'm saying? At the beginning, you always want to like build it up. 
scale up and uh, take advantage of the uh, statistical laws of uh, probabilities based on how the uh, trends and patterns is forming. You see that the ball is uh, trending to a certain side. You want to take advantage. We already know that each column, each row, each... Uh, let just go back. Each column, each row is uh, divided by 33%. So we see that it's trending to a certain section. You know what I'm saying? I think I went way back. All right, hold on. I need, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to log in. I think I logged out by accident. Let me log in. I'm gonna have to blur out my email. Don't want everybody. You know, oh, and I'm still logged in. All right, we're gonna let the balance uh, refresh. There you go. All right, so what I was saying, what I was saying is that you see that the ball is trending to a certain section, a certain uh segment of the roulette wheel. Then just uh, go for it and manage your risk. Is honestly, it's all about risk management and uh, flipping up on them. You gotta flip up on them. You know what I'm saying? You gotta switch sides. You gotta do contrarian betting method. You gotta do the five rising star unit, which I'll probably focus more on part six of uh, me versus Lucky Red Casino. Even though I'm up a hundred bucks, it took way uh, a little too long. You know what I'm saying? But the, but that's the realities of gambling. You know what I'm saying? I don't show you guys the highlights. I show you guys from start to finish how to, you know, win money, take money from casinos and things of that nature. And basically, if I would have gotten greedy, uh, if I would have gotten greedy, I would I probably would have lost. And that's that that's the truth. If I would have, like, raised my bet and betted 100 bucks on every round, I probably would have lost. You know what I'm saying? You want to, like, uh, play smooth and, you know, let the uh, the laws of probabilities and statistics uh, move in your favor. This is part five, Ecom Society versus uh, Lucky Red Casino. How to make money on, uh, online with uh, casino gambling. You know what I'm saying? $100 net profit in uh, less than an hour. I'm out for now, yo. Peace.